Rodman with Sports Chiropractic. And a lot of people have pain or headaches in their neck when they wake up. And there's really nothing that happens at night. They don't, you know, have an injury. So like, why does this happen every morning? I have neck pain or I have a headache or my neck is really stiff and I went to sleep feeling fine. So a lot of it is the way you sleep. So we always talk about sleeping face down. That's the number one no-no. We really want to break that habit. That's the worst way to sleep. Second best way is to sleep on your side. And we've made videos about side sleeping. Today we want to talk about back sleeping, which is the best way to sleep and how it can be made the most effective. And a lot of people ask us, what pillow should I get? And I wanna say, you know, your pillow is probably fine, but here's something you can do at home to add to your pillow to make it a perfect pillow. And what I tell patients is we want to, when we sleep, a lot of times we have problems because we don't support the curve in the neck. We wanna keep the curve in the neck when we sleep. And a lot of pillows are really tall and they kind of push our head forward. And now our neck muscles are getting strained all night and that also puts a lot of pressure on the discs in the neck the further flexed we are like this. So we want to avoid that. And also we want to avoid our head flopping to the side. And that happens a lot of times for back sleepers because there's nothing to cradle and support the head from rolling this way. When we do this, we're stretching these muscles out all night and we're really jamming this side of the neck, the joints in this side of the neck. So a simple thing I tell my patients to do is just take a, a bath towel Fold it in half, and from here, you're gonna fold it again. Just gonna get it in that kind of eye-like position, and now you're just going to uh, fold it one more time and roll it. Actually, sorry, I'm gonna keep it like that, but we're gonna roll it up. And from here, we're just gonna put it into a zero or an O, and we're gonna put that into our pillowcase. And why are we gonna do that? Because this is actually going to support the curve in the neck, and these sides are gonna keep our head from tilting from side to side. So what I mean is you're just gonna slide this into a pillowcase like this. So you can kind of see that O shape right there. And from here, I have this part that's gonna push into the curve in my neck to support that. So you can see it's kind of giving me a cervical curve. And these two parts on the side are preventing my head from really falling to the side. You know, it doesn't totally stop my head and barricade it, but it gives it just enough to make sure I'm not really doing this at night. So that's why I like putting a towel in there as opposed to like an airplane pillow in there because that's really restrictive and very hard to sleep with. So hope you learned a lot from today. Um, we wanna sleep on our back if possible. This makes it a lot more comfortable, supports the curve in the neck, prevents your head from tilting to the side, and allows you a lot more comfort in sleeping on your back. So give this a try at home. If you like this, please share it with your friends. Could save them some neck pain, stiffness, and headaches. Dr. Robin, have a great day.